love is in the air, but what if it isn't? How do you avoid all the PDA and the restaurants filled with red and pink balloons? It could just be a lot. Yeah, because you're not always feeling it. So our next guest is back to tell us how to be single, but still fabulous, of course, with some <laughs> options for celebrating anti-Valentine's <laughs> Day. So please welcome lifestyle expert Bradley Burgess Donaleski. Hey, y'all. Happy Valentine's Day. Hi. <laughs> or happy anti-Valentine's anti Day. If you're like me, you're celebrating with my two dates I have every year. Their names are Ben and Jerry. Maybe you've met oh, them. Perfect. Um, I like a little chubby hubby myself. Haven't yeah. met one yet, but whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds good to me. So tell us about Operation Bang and Burn. So yeah, Operation Bang and Burn tonight, 8 p.m. to 2 a.m. And that's at Safe House Chicago. You can bring an item that reminds you of your ex to burn in their fiery inferno. Oh. Right? <laughs> for a chance to win a hundred dollar bar tab for future use. That's so amazing. Pretty cool. They're gonna have like better than happy hour specials. They're gonna have karaoke all night to sing your heart out. You do have to register on Eventbrite to do it okay. and you have to be present to win the prize. The idea <laughs> of just taking like something physical and just burning it. Burning like, it. The actual act of doing that yeah. it must feel so good. It's gonna be a sweet release, right? Honestly. Like <laughs> yeah. Yeah. There we go. So uh, tell us about anti-Valentine's Edition. Okay, so anti-Valentine's Day prom edition, Simone's and Pilsen, tonight from 9 p.m. to 2 a.m. No date, no problem. It's their second annual anti-Valentine's Day party, and girl, it's a prom. So they're going to have Ew. broken heart-shaped pizza to eat your feelings, <gasps> drink a I mess, right? Drink all the specialty cocktails you can handle, dance the pain away with Presto, and the coolest thing, your raffle tickets do become voting ballots for Pilsen's 2019 prom king and queen. Oh, my gosh. Very cool. These are so cool. <laughs> I won both in high school. Oh, <laughs> Okay, there's another one, Love Bites, Valentine's Haunted House. So that's this weekend, the 15th and 16th, 7 p.m., 13th floor, Chicago, Love Bites. So va uh, basically, vampires have taken over the 13th floor, <laughs> right? <laughs> Your mission, with the help of their vampire hunting experts, navigate the 13th floor, vanquish the bloodthirsty demon, sounds like my love life, and oh, escape, no. basically. Only the bravest will survive, so definitely check out their website for tickets. They're on sale now. It's going to be a really cool event, and honestly, that sounds what fun to me. What in the world? Halloween is an I would be scared, but I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> Halloween is in Something October. for everyone, though. It's not right? scarier than my last date. I'm fine. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Stupid Cupid party. Nah, it's, that's tonight from 7 p.m. to 2 uh, to 12 a.m. Sorry, Stupid Cupid anti-Valentine's Day party at Fishman's Public House. Now, basically, they're going to have some voodoo doll pin cushions so you can, like, have <laughs> a few names to curse oh, while you're watching no. anti-Valentine's Day. Oh. Yeah, I'm ready for that. Just I am down. Just because you're single, you can't put this bad energy out there. I am ready to give the juju <laughs> to every one of my exes, all right? That's Fishman's Public House tonight, 7 p.m. to 12 12 a.m. Gonna be so much fun. Definitely show up and get wrecked. <laughs> okay. And this last one, I love this idea. Name a cockroach. Tell us about this. Okay, so this is not local, but this Valentine's Day, you can name a cockroach after one of your exes, and the good folks of the El Paso Zoo will do you a favor and in your honor feed that cockroach. <laughs> <laughs> to their meerkats, which is pretty cool. Not local, but you can still register to participate online to make sure that your ex gets the karma they so richly deserve. This I have a very love. special surprise for you guys. Right not here, right now. We're gonna cockroaches. name some cockroaches live. What? <laughs> We're gonna name cockroaches <gasps> right here, what? right now in the you gym. Guys, <laughs> I hate cockroaches. I am also pretty grossed out by oh, this prospect. You didn't but say that when I am like, oh. <laughs> oh, All right, girls. You guys, so I these are actual Madagascar hissing cockroaches that they'll be feeding to their meerkats for you at El Paso Zoo. I'm going to start. Okay. We're going to call this one... His name is Kyle. We all have a Kyle, ladies, right? He's somewhere uh, sure. like <laughs> pounding a four loco and not calling you back. That's what Kyles do. Oh, oh my God. I'm going to call <laughs> this one over here. His name is Jeremy, and he knows what he did. All right? He knows. Okay. What about you? What you got? Oh, my God. Who's this one? Um, Joe from the show You. Jo because he's oh. super creepy and has a lot of bad things. Honestly, I'd just be so flattered if he was stalking me. Um, <laughs> Felicia, what do you I got? Got people. <laughs> I got people. I got a few. I'll give you one of my friend's exes because um, all my exes watch the show. <laughs> you don't want them actually turning mm. into roaches and coming for you. Uh, yeah, don't, don't want them to come haunt me. Uh, 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 I can't. Will. We'll name him. What, what did he do? I'm kidding. Uh, well, I'll He's, leave her business alone. But where's he going into the mouth of a meerkat? How yeah, hopefully. That? Crunch, crunch. I'm ready. Oh I mean, gosh. honestly, if they're dipping chocolate, I eat one right now. I'll yeah. eat anything. Uh, like, not a problem. Clearly. All right, on that more note. info and more on Bradley, just visit his Instagram page at Bradley K8 Olson, right? That's and right, Bradley K8 Olson.